to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. And if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. And the weighted pass. He's got options out wide. Firmly met. Tries to get it forward quickly. Just brushed off the ball there. Hit long and direct. Chance to squeeze it through. No, not quite. Has he found his man? Done very well to intervene. Oh, we don't even need to look at the stats, do we, Peter? Zero attempts, zero goals, and uh, excitement, forget it. Looks to bypass the midfield. Long ball, but not especially accurate. Drives it towards the front. Over to the left. Half an hour played now. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Driving on, a real charge here. Here's the delivery. Corner then. They've played it short. There are a few waiting for it. Plenty waiting in the middle. Aimed in towards the centre. Gets into a dangerous position. And the half-time whistle goes. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. Been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. Reflections on the first half. It's been a pretty abject performance. No effort at goal. I'm struggling to remember the last time we had that. So they head in no further forward. The score here still nil-nil.
Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped. Lots of effort, but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone can step up and produce something a little more magical. Tries a shot! And yes, it's there! And finally, he has breathed life into the game! Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. So we have our breakthrough. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. And it's played forward. Hoists it forward. The ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Gets away from his opponent. And it's hoisted clear. What a good way to assert your authority for this second period. They were prepared to commit numbers forward into attacking positions, and the risk has been deservedly rewarded. Hit into the middle. Knocks it away, out towards the flank. That is terrific skill. Your impression so far, Jim? There's a lot of football still to be played, Peter, so ideally they need to maintain a, an attacking endeavour. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. Out to the left it goes. Gorgeous control there. Time to deliver. The only goal came in the early moments of the second period, and the score is 1-0. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. One nil as we head towards the end. Well, that's where he wants it. He's being closely tested here. It is just a question of running down the clock now. Forward it goes. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. It upfield, and that is it. The referee has seen enough. What a game! End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to.